We have a lunatic fringe right wingers that are both corrupt and take money from weapons manufacturers and have lost their minds and belong in mental asylums who are like, oh yeah, we'll give a assault rifle to a assault weapon to a 14 year old and have him walk around and see if we can agitate him. <laughs> and they think that's normal. No, you belong in an asylum. Every and by the way, passed easily. Right, the vote was overwhelming. Let the 14 year olds walk around. Yeah. Hopefully, they'll kill a whole bunch of people. It'll be great. Idiots in Missouri, total morons. Every Republican that voted for that is a monster. Well, voted against it voted because against the proposal it, yes. was to ban minors from open carry in the state of Missouri. And I do want to give the one Republican who proposed this and voted in favor of it some credit. It's a State Representative, again, a Republican, Lane Roberts. He's a former Joplin, Missouri police chief and state public safety director. And he's like, yo, this is not, this is not a good idea. Now, I also want to read a quote from another Republican lawmaker who does not deserve credit and should be shamed at the idiotic statement he made. So this is Missouri State Representative Tony Lavasco who says, well, it may be intuitive that a 14 year old has no legitimate purpose. It doesn't actually mean that they're going to harm someone. We don't know that yet. Generally speaking, we don't charge people with crimes because we think they're going to hurt someone. Okay, great. So why do we have any regulations as it pertains to minors, right? Minors as young as 10 should be able to get behind the wheel. We don't know that they're gonna cause a car accident. We don't know that they're gonna drive recklessly. So why have any regulations at all as it pertains to minors? And by the way, on weapons, why stop it at assault weapons? Why not start handing out grenades to 14 year olds? By the way, Republicans in Congress, there's a one lunatic who from Florida who did start handing out grenades. He's like, no, 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 they're inert. They probably won't explode. And His luckily he gave it to inert. fellow, okay. I know, exactly. <laughs> So look, guys, we're talk, uh, pointing out the one Republican that voted the right way. I think over 100 voted the wrong way uh, in Missouri. Because whenever we find a Republican legislator in the country that is not insane, like what, like it's like breaking news. We found one Republican in Missouri that is not a lunatic. Breaking news, breaking news. And by the way, why? Because he's a former police chief. He's like, are you serious? And you know who's complaining about this rule? The cops. Cops are like. You're gonna send us out there yep. with heavily armed teenagers yep. that can just roam around. Are you guys nuts? Is this is this helping the cops? Does this look like you're in favor of the thin blue line? I don't know anything that endangers cops more than this. How are you gonna disarm these kids? Okay. And by the way, of course, they had to sprinkle in racism, right? They're like, oh yeah, we should be able to carry guns around in the white areas and stuff. But for the black areas, they wanted to have an extra prosecutor. So they're like, now remember, we're supposed to let all the white folks go, okay? But for the black areas, if you see him, you know what to do, extra prosecutor. Jesus Christ.